hooked up. Oh my gosh. What's going on guys? Welcome back. Today we catch a true urban giant in a small apartment pond on a $5 Walmart fishing rod. It's absolutely insane. My new PB. I've never caught a freshwater fish out of a pond this big in my entire life. But before we get into today's video, I want to thank Mystery Tackle Box, our sponsor on today's episode, man. Literally the best gift for the angler in your life. My wife and I have been using Mystery Tackle Box for the last two years. They send you a mystery box of baits every single month, literally like Christmas, every single month. For example, in this month's box, we have some of the best baits to fish during the winter time. Jerk baits, small swim baits, we've got a spinner bait, lipless crank, we've got some craws and hooks included in the box and literally tips and tricks on how to fish every single bait and you'll get this every single month. Right now Mystery Tackle Box is doing the biggest sale of the year and has the cheapest prices on these boxes so be sure to check that out down below and if we can get this video to 2,000 likes we're gonna go and target some more massive species like in today's video. Let's go ahead and get into it. Welcome back to the channel. We're trying to catch some giant carp in an urban atmosphere, literally an apartment complex that has some of the most gigantic fish you've ever seen in your life. We were this close already within minutes. We're gonna see if we can't link up with one of these guys. Stay tuned. All right, here's the cheap Shakespeare Walmart rod right here. I've got my trout nugget, um, corn would work. It's just a small hook. Probably could even use a smaller hook to be quite honest. Uh, <laughs> And I've got like 50 pound braid on this thing because these are big fish with a, I believe, 15 or 20 pound fluorocarbon leader here. So we're going to see what happens. Let's go try and get us one. What's going on, man? Hey. You're going to try and get some fish out here. <laughs> Thank you, dude. Yeah, oh, like, oh. Uh, foliage dying down. Oh, no way. I think we found him. First carp of the day, guys. Thanks huge. The wind. The wind is killing us. Dude, I don't know if this is, this gotta be the same one. Oh, there we go. Dude, we're literally about to, I think we're gonna get him. Oh, he wants it now. Now he wants it. Oh, he's going to, he's going to, he's going to. It's gotta be the same one. Ryan's casting in for bass. We kind of brought a bass fishing setup too, just in case we see some giants. Bunch of fish over there, dude, crazy. There we go, got one. Jerk bait. Come on up, killer. All right, man. Sick. Oh, I just had it again. Oh my gosh. I just had to eat it again. <sighs> Hi. How you doing? Oh my gosh. Hooked up. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Uh, Ryan. Okay. Let's see if we can land this thing. Mm, might be risky. Might be risky. Uh, but what I need to do is get this rod. We need to, uh, we need to take him to a bank. So I got to get him away from here, basically. Okay. This is going to be tricky. Let me try and hand it to you through here. And then I'll try and get even further. That's good, that's good, that's good. Okay, now if you can hand it to me around this tree, and then I'll hand it to you around the next tree. All right, we're gonna try and land them on a bank over there, but this is gonna be too tough. Um, here, now. I'm gonna go untangle that, you just stay here. Okay. All right. Okay, thank you. Oh my gosh. This thing's probably 40 pounds. Walmart setup here. This is gonna be tricky. Ryan's in the tree. Oh my god. We just need the twig. Oh no. I think we lost him. Oh, oh we got him. We got him. We got him. We got him. I'm tightening a little bit. I'm trying. Okay. All right. We got this guy. I would too. Oh my god. This thing's a giant. 
He's trying to go. Come on, baby. Nice and easy over to the other side. Okay, guys, I'm trying to keep the drag just right. Like, I have to keep this stuff pretty loose. This is a tiny hook, easily bent out if this guy really starts thrashing and running on us. We're trying to get him over to the shallow bank so we can actually land this true giant. Very tricky right now. He's trying to get up on these uh, branches. They could easily snap us off on this light fluorocarbon. All right, I'm gonna keep him right here till Ryan gets back. Perfect spot to try and land this. All right, y'all, we're taking the, go we're gonna have to take the GoPro off for a second. Oh my God. <laughs> Dang, this water is cold, by the way, Ryan. Holy cow. I'm surprised he hasn't ran. It's just so cold. There you go. Come here. Oh my gosh. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. I want to be as gentle as possible with this fish. It's like wrestling a freaking bear. Oh my god, dude. Okay. Oh my god, he's flexing okay. so hard. You want me to get him? Yeah, we can. Yeah. Oh. Oh god. Oh. All right, y'all. Absolutely the biggest fish I have ever caught in my life. Is this a grass carp? Dude, this thing's got to be 30, 40 pounds. I'm going to go ahead and get a release on this thing. But holy smokes, what a thrill ride. Let's just let her go nice and easy. I don't know if there's such a thing as nice and easy with her. Come on. Here you go, Big Bertha. There you go. There you go. Oh. Oh, yeah. Cruising. <sighs> Crazy, dude. Ryan rigged. Y'all drop a sub to the man behind the camera right here. Let's do it. We not have done it without him. She is cruising. And we accomplished our mission, man. Walmart gear catches the biggest fish ever. Freaking urban Dallas apartment community. Would you believe it? Okay. Time to clean up. I might have to go for a swim. That was a little intense. A little slimier than the bass I usually catch. By the way, Marcos is catching some bass too. Show the man, dude. He just pulled in. I think he's had like two or three bass since we've been here. Just patiently waiting for us to possibly link up with this. Anyways, we done it. On with the big and as soon as we let the carp go. <laughs> no way. This is insane. I'm freezing cold trying to wash off in this water. So, so cold, guys. That's a two, three pound. That's two pounds. Easy. Slow, 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 slow. Woo! Okay. Yeah, okay, yeah, just bring it in. We get okay. It. We gotta man him up then. Man him up. Bring him on. Whew. Is that light line or is it good? Uh, it's eight pounds. It's, it's okay. Oh, eight pound? Yeah. <laughs> that's light. <laughs> Dang, yeah, that's, dude, that's solid. Yes. That's the biggest one of the day, right? That's the biggest one in a while. Yo. This pond. Ah, <laughs> check him out, dude. Do you have an Instagram or anything? Are you on? Yeah. Yeah? I'll have to drop your Instagram. Right. You'll have to hit me up, dude. That's yep. so sick. <laughs> With a big old bass right after the carp. Hold on, y'all can't even see. We got some sick, dude. <laughs> That's a solid bass. Another picture? <laughs> Another picture? I totally forgot, man. Phone came out of my pocket, took the Apple Watch off. Everything was soaked. Dude, that is a solid fish. It got me stone cold. <laughs> so catch I know, dude. Me and Ryan are having a hard time on the bass lately, but nope. <laughs> oh, see you. We're the heading out. Nice catch, bro. Appreciate it. Oh, yeah. All right, y'all. Well, quick recap. Uh, I incurred a little bit of a battle scar myself here. Not quite sure what's going on, but I'm going to get home, toss a little something on there, and uh, probably ice that puppy up so I don't get some crazy winter carp infection. <laughs> By the way, if y'all want to snag one of the Carl's Bait and Tackle Holiday sweaters, there might be a few left before they are completely gone. I'm going to go ahead, like I say, get dressed and probably head out of here because I got a little bit of a drive home. We're feeling accomplished, man. That was absolutely insane. I'll hit y'all with a brief recap back at the house. All right, guys, we hope you enjoyed this episode. New species, new PB, so sick. Don't forget to check out our sponsor, Mystery Tackle Box, and grab you a box for yourself. And also, drop that thumbs up. We got a lot more interesting videos coming y'all's way, so be ready, be prepared, be on the lookout. We'll catch you then. Peace. <gasps> Thank you